played to LSK the Game, I'm Lisa Kellett. And I am Young Kim. Welcome to part two of our Soyan or the West Coast Special. All right, Young, get a lot of this fresh air. We're in the midst of nature, in the wild. I feel great. Where are we? Well, we're here in the South Chungcheong province in Poryong. And we're at the Songju Mountain Natural Recreation Park. And we're here for part two of our special. That's right. right. It's beautiful. It's nice. It's fabulous. Mountainous. <laughs> All right, but of course we can't start without the rest of our family. Let's call out the LSK game contestants. Come on, everybody. Yeah. Yeah. This is part two of our West Coast special. Today's location is Mount Songju Natural Recreation Forest. Our contestants arrive after a two and a half hour drive from Seoul. It's a competition in the great outdoors. Who will be the winner of today's game? Today we're going to continue on with our special to Seoul An. Today we're going to continue on with the games and the fun and the Korean learning. But first, let's split into teams. Everyone, we're just going to make it simple. Rock, paper, scissors. Put your hat out there. Let's say it together. You have won every single team Ooh. elimination here. Okay, now it's time for Eric to choose your teammate. Will it be Cherish, who you teamed up with last week? Will it be Christine, or will it be Amr? Go ahead. Amr and I have seen uh, Brokeback Mountain together. Um, <laughs> I think it's time. Let's do this. Yeah, don't make me quit you. Don't make All me right. quit you. Represent like this, bro. I'm doing it. It's Christine and Cherish, Girls Power versus Amur and Eric, Param Dungi. Basically, for part one, our very first challenge is a type of treasure hunt. You're looking for our vocabulary words hidden anywhere from the front of the stream to the big, large rock. Find the hidden words near the stream. There are seven words between rocks and trees. Where could they be? Good luck finding them all. Round one. All right, let's say a, a word of, uh, I don't know, who wrote to each other. Girls, we will show you some real girl power. And, and we will up. hide you under the rocks. Yeah! yeah. What do you have to say to that, guys? You will see whether the girls deserve the right to vote or not. <laughs> That's so deep! Whoa! Whoa! All right, can you feel the tension? Let's get started! You've got three seconds on the clock, starting! Now! Yeah. Yeah. Three nights. 
and so oh, sure. One for each of us. Job. One for each of us. So there's no points for that. Yeah. Woo. Seoul. Um, Seoul, the capital Lord. city of Korea. Yeah. Alright, so this count. One, two, three, Second. four, Second. five. Second. For a total of 50 points, the first round winner. Now the wonderful city of Seoul is located right in the heart of Korea. It is the capital city, also the most populated city in Korea. Here, if you only had 24 hours, I would probably recommend my top three destinations would be Dongdaemun. You can enjoy 24 hour shopping into the wee hours of the night, plus some delicious food. Then hop on over to Gyeongbokgung, where you can experience the 5,000 year magnificent history of Korea, plus Namsan, where you can experience the night view of Korea. Next up, Busan. Busan is located on the southernmost tip of Korea. It has a beautiful harbor coastline and lots of wonderful beaches. Don't forget to go to Haeundae if you're a big water sports fan, plus if you love lots of seafood. Now one marketplace I would probably recommend for great seafood is Jagalchishja. Oh, makes me think of all this wonderful seafood. I really want to go there. Bye! Jeju-do, Purumbam. Now look behind us, Jeju-do, also known as Jeju Island. It is the premier island south of Korea, and it is uh, part of Korea as well. It's one of the most visited tourist attractions. Many people from all over the world come and flock just to see Jeju Island. Next is Sokcho. Ta-da! Okay, we have the special at the Sohan, which is the west coast. Sokcho lies on the east coast, or the Tonghan. Say it with me, guys. Tonghan and Sokcho. Sokcho is known for the Sorak Mountain, which provides great scenery. And not only that, you can climb that mountain, you can go hiking, and uh, you cannot leave out kwe, which is basically raw fish or Korean sushi. It just tastes awesome. Oh my god, speaking of kwe, I think I gotta go have some right now. Where's Lisa? Kwe! Oh, Yan, Korea is such a wonderful place. So many things to do and see and eat. I love Korea. Of course. I mean, where else can you go to find four beautiful seasons mm. like these? All right. Well, this is the reason why you have to know this word. You have to travel. Yohang. Yohang. And which means to travel all around Korea, right? To explore, to look around, to travel. Yohang. Yohang. Traveling is one of the premier things in Korea and you have to do it once you're here. Okay, now if you do go, if you do go on a trip or a yohang, you're not going to go for just one or two days. You'll probably go for three or even four, right? But basically, people don't have that much time working, you know, a nine to five. They'll usually take the weekend and go for two days, okay? But if you go for two days, you would stay at least one night there. And how do you say a two day trip or a one night and two day trip? Well, check it out. Ilbak year. That is one night and two days. Ilbak year. And the second most common, perhaps, length of stay would be sambak sahe. Sambak sahe. This pak means nights. So three nights, sambak, sahe, four days. So obviously, il must mean days. Let's try it together. Sambak sahe. Sambak sahe. Three nights and four days in Seoul City. Should we go on a trip? Why not? How about a trip back into the studio? Let's go together, okay? Let's go, bye! No, I'm in a real trip. For round two, I've been given a wick or ah, sweepers. What is this? It's for you to plug it right back here, just like me. Ah. Whoa. Whoa. Catch the other team's tail. The team to catch the other team's tail wins. Which team will be the first to catch the tail? Round two. We bet it all! We bet it all! We bet it all! Ten points! Alright, what well, do you, you think? We can play the same. Do 
Let's do it. Let's do this. All right. Double or nothing, baby. Woo! 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 One, two, three, four. Pure test got your own. You go, you go. Yeah. All right. One, two, three, go. We don't need the furballs. We got hormones. in round two. Girls power has zero. Madam Dingy team is in the lead with 100 more points. Annyeonghaseya, Yorubun. John and Eric Imnida. Onurun MT Wasayo. Jamie in an episode, Dulyo Dulyokeyo. We played in the water and had some great food. The LSK retreat was so much fun. It's getting late! It's time to get out of this pool, get upstairs, shower, and eat! Ooh, yeah. Let's, go. Let's go! But it's not like us to just relax. Emmer had lots of fun and took a refreshing shower. Emmer is feeling great at the retreat. But right then... Oh, strange, where's the rings? Eric, you finished it! Eric, bring me some rings here, please! Hey, I think it seems that Amara is calling you. Really? Yeah. 
He's asking me to bring him some rins, okay? But it's just over there. Just come on and get it. Okay, I'll bring him some. I've got your rins. Take my rents. Dad, what's that? What? This is rents, right? The rins means the conditioner you used after shampoo for your hair. Oops, my mistake. Oh my god! Look, it got so dark today. Yeah, you have some freckles now. Oh, yeah, it's so oh. bad. Oh, oh, look at my pimples. Oh. Lotions are a must in order to maintain your beauty. Oh, why? It's finished? Oops. Oh, it's okay. Eric, can you get Eric? Some, some skin here, please? Yeah, we need it. Oh, okay, I'm coming. Eric to the rescue. What? You said you wanted some of my skin. Uh, no. no! It's not your skin that we're talking about. It's this one. This in Korean, they call it skin. This is what we need. Oh! But my skin is much better, right? Well, everyone, I hope you enjoyed that episode. It was a great time, as you can see. As you saw, I made a few mistakes, but I learned a lot, made a lot of fun, and had a great time. Everyone, let's speak Korean, the game. Sarang hey What's up, Lisa? Give me some skin. Some skin. Some You know, it never ceases to surprise me how many of these things there are. I think it's because cultures meet cultures, languages meet languages, and things are always changing around us. So like that first one, skin. Skin. Especially for like men and women, when they wake up in the morning after shower, that's the first thing they put on. We call it toner or uh -huh. like, um, what else? What well, skin right? lotion, right. basically. Skin lotion, right. So they call it skin here. All right, anyways, everyone, let's wrap things up. We're going to move on. Are, are you guys feeling a little hungry? Feel a little too Yeah! yeah. 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 Shows off some Bruce Lee Chargabang moves. There are two questions. Keep your eyes on the Chargabang if you want to succeed. Round three. All right, let's show our audience what the expression is. Okay. All right, guys, get your eyes ready. Don't sprain your necks. I'm going to go out of the way. Ready? All right, ready. Whoa! 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 Shake it for the guy. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. What's that? Let's see. Let's see. One more time, please. You got it. One more time. Listen, last solidarity, brother. Bro, guys. See it? Bro, solidarity. No. Easier. Easier. Be our brother. Oh, 
ขอเสียงแค่เซกันส์เซกันส์เอ็ดเซเว่นสิกไฟฟ์สองสามสี่สี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่สองสามสี่ Obviously, if you're a part of an office or a group, we go out to a different city or camping or uh, skiing somewhere. It's a group trip that you take. You eat, you drink, and you enjoy activities together. And by doing this, you become closer. You get to know each other better, and so you kind of bond. Mm -hmm. Okay, and that's what membership training is called. So in this sentence, we said. เพศหา that's your office or company let's say it together เพศหาเพศหาเพศหาเพศหา okay and say this word you can say ฮักยูฮักยูสอง okay and this เอสหา is giving direction at school or from school so at the office we went on an MT and the verb here is ขายูขาดา is the verb to go somewhere so we went on an MT in our office or from our company เพศไอซ์เอ็ MT ไคล but here I'm sorry I should correct myself it's more like we will be going on one in this sentence let's repeat together เพศไอซ์เอ็ MT ไคล we say it's all MT ไคล okay ladies we say it's all MT ไคล and then one more time เพศไอซ์เอ็ MT ไคล replace เพศ with ฮักยูฮักยูเอซ์เอ็ MT ไคล학교에서 MT 가요. 학교에서 MT 가요. Sounds so good. They're in unison. Yeah. Okay, guys. Can't let them beat you. 학교에서 MT 가요. All right. Now, 잘 갔다 오세요. So it sounds like there are two verbs here. Let's break it up. Okay. So what do we do well here? 가요, 가요. And then when we change this into the past tense, it's 가다 오다, right? 오세요 is coming. So 오다 is the present verb to come. So going and coming well on your way. 잘 갔다 오세요. And you may think, why don't you just say 잘 가세요? Okay. Like usually when you're sending someone off uh, for, for good, good. Yeah. then you say 잘 가세요. Right, or you don't know when they're going to come back. But in this situation, you know they're going to go on a short trip and come back. So it's almost like bidding them farewell and at the same time hoping for their safe return. It's all built in there. So we say it together. Tai kata uzheo. Let's say it together. Tai kata uzheo. Tai kata uzheo. Ladies. Will you say you're going on a company meeting and will you say You want a comeback? Girl Power wins 100 points in round three. It's a tie. I do see we have a tally of points and look at this. This is one of our very first times we've had a tie. That's right, 100 points. Three. 100 points each. But I'm sorry to say we cannot continue on with a tie. We must find one team to move on. So what to do? Bonus round. Ooh. Erase your boards. Erase your boards. You are going to give be given a bonus question. It's going to be worth. Count him. Fifty. Fifty points. All right. So Lisa, do you have the question ready? I do. Are you guys ready? Yes. Yeah. All right. Girl power. Ready. Ready. L S K M T is what? What we're doing right now, right? Okay. Where is the L S K M T taking place right now? Where are we? 우리가 지금 어디에 와 있어요? Where are we? Ten seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Three, 
two, one. Ding, 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 ding. Flip over your chalkboards, please. And the answer to the quiz question, and that's for 50 points that'll move the team into the next round, is we are standing on Songju Sun. Bottom three team answers the bonus question and moves on to round four with 150 points. Congratulations! Congratulations. Thanks. We finished with 150 points. This okay. means that you guys will go on to round four, uh -huh. where we will divvy your points. You'll each start with 75 points apiece. And now you are no longer a team. You're playing as individual teams. You have to split us up because there's too much right. testosterone. That's right. That's right. Now it's Eric <laughs> yeah. against Amr. All right. Starting in round four, 75 75. We're going to have to see exactly what happens next on LSK yeah. The, the Game. game. in our hands are a bunch of scrambled words which make one sentence. Put the sentence together and write it on the blackboard. This is a game that displays the wit and speed of the contestants, who will be the winner of round four. Round four. Starting now. Remember, just 40 seconds, all right? Almer and Eric working quickly to form their sentences. Uh, it's just actually 20 seconds left, guys. Turning the words around, actually, because like I said, it's a very long, difficult sentence. All right, 10 seconds to write your sentences. If you don't have anything written, you get nothing right. Five seconds. Here's your last clue as you're writing. After coming to Korea is the first sentence. earlier, it is a longer and more difficult sentence, but let's break it down for you. 한국에 와서 여행해 본적 있어요? 한국에, at Korea or in Korea, and then 와서. Earlier we learned the expression 잘 갔다 오세요. 오다 is the verb to come. Past tense is 왔어요, and we've shortened that to 와서. Let's put it together with the first word. 한국에 와서, after coming to Korea, have you traveled around? 여행해 본적 있어요? Have you traveled around Korea after coming to Korea? So obviously this is an expression that we may most likely use with guests from foreign countries or someone who may not have lived here for a long time. So for example, I may ask Armor, 한국에 와서 여행해 본적 있어요? 네, 있어요. Good. 한국에 와서 여행해 본적 있어요? 네, 있어요. Good. Now, 해본 적 있어요. 하다 is the verb to do, right? And the 보다 is also another verb. Uh, basically, you're putting these two together, and what happens is that it becomes experience. Right, right. because 해, you do it and you see it. Exactly. 해본 적. 적 is like, have you ever done this? Was there a time that you did this? 해본 적 있어요? Is have you ever done this, right? So you put 여행 in front of that, and that's travel. 여행 해본 적 있어요? Put that together with uh, the first part where it was 한국에 와서. Have you ever come to Korea? Or after coming to Korea, have you ever traveled around Korea? 한국에 와서 여행 해본 적 있어요? 한국에 와서 여행 해본 적 있어요? Okay, so it's two fragments that you actually put together. And ta you have a very long and complicated, apparently complicated sentence, but it's not so complicated at all. All right. Amur wins round four. He is in the lead with 50 more points. All right, round five. This is where all the action begins. Yep. This time, 
you two are playing. Actually, you have no memory. A case of lost memories. Where have they been for the past week? Bring back the contestants' memory. Where have they been? Round five. Who are you? Why am I? Where are you? Now you will receive treatment, hypnotic treatment for your amnesia. Can you recover your memory? Can this man, Genie the Hypnotist, can he do it? Shall we begin? And now the Hypnotist is going to officially go into the trance. Now the two people are trying to recover their memory and he will begin now. My ring. Let go of my rays. Faster, 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 faster. And when I count three, you'll be a one, two, three. The first round has ended. Now let's try to find your memory. Let's try to recover that memory that you have lost because of this condition called amnesia. First, Eric. Eric, you cannot remember the last week. You have to recover your memory of the last week. Now, Jinu, the superb hypno hypnosis, hypnotist, gets back into action and puts him in a deeper trance. He will help you remember where you were in the last week. Now you're in a deep trance, Eric. For some reason, you feel good. You smile. Big smile. Like you saw a hot chick. Yes, and all of a sudden you remember. Oh, you, you remember. It's a port city. Yes, Busan. And here is the question. In Korean, tell me, I've been to Busan. Busan is like I'm going to say. Now, it's time for Amur's turn. You are trying to find the lost week as well. And you are slowly thinking, Oh, I think I remember something. Yes, you do remember something. You remember going to Seoul. Here is your question. Have you been to Seoul? Now answer this question in Korean. I have been to Seoul. Seoul에 갔어요. This time, we're going to continue the hypnosis because it looks like it's not really working that well since you got the questions incorrect. So, we want to find out more details about this trip. Now, you feel big, you feel heavy, you feel with a trunk coming out of your nose, nose, face. You are an elephant. Yes, a pink elephant, quiet but pink, and a green elephant. Yes, stand up. You're, you're heavy, heavy. You're looking for food. But instead of that, you just see yourself as ballerinas. Yeah, ballerinas. Yes, no, yes, Woo. jump. Woo! It's it. Now, you grab him. Any one of you, raise him. Yes, prima ballerina. And then you try to jump again, but you collide. You fall down! Yes. That's much better, Pink Elephant. Now, Pink Elephant, you said you've been to Busan. Three nights and four days. Three nights and four days. In Korean, can you tell me three nights and four days? Sapak. Samyeok. Now, it is Amour's turn. Amour, you feel like the ballerina and elephant training have gotten you someplace. You remember going to Seoul for how many days? Six nights and seven days. Now, tell us in Korean. Six nights, seven days. Yukbat Chiriryo. Now, now you have, you're greedy now, because uh, 
The hypnotist knows his powers are strong and they work, so he's getting greedy. He wants you to do something more. He pulls out an onion. No, no, no. It's a delicious, yummy apple. Love it. He's asking you to take it and eat it. Yes. Eat yes. the onion that Love the hypnotist it. gives you. Delicious. Shake it into Juicy your hands. Apple. It tastes just really like good. a delicious apple. Eat it. Eat it like a yummy apple. Eat it. Oh, it's so delicious. The two people are eating it. Amur and Eric, they like the apple. Apples are very delicious. You love it. All of a sudden, you wake up from your trance. <laughs> and you realize you're eating an onion. It tastes horrible. It's spicy. What have you been doing? You pass out because it's so gross. <laughs> pass out because they are so gross and you lose your memory again. The end. Jim, run away! Eric has 75 points. Amur has 155. Amur is leading with 80 more points. All right, let's get back to our expressions, though. Earlier in the previous round, we asked, after coming to Korea, have you ever traveled around Korea? 한국에 와서 여행해본 적 있어요? And you may answer with this sentence. 부산에 가봤어요. Busan에, to Busan, or you can say Seoul에, well, to Boryong, where we are right now, Boryong에, right? To Boryong, to Seoul, to Busan, 가봤어요. 가다 is the verb, to go, and then 보다, okay, is to see something. Mm -hmm. You went and you saw, you came back, you experienced it. So I went and I took a trip around Busan, basically. So let's try repeating that. Busan에. And we're saying this in the past tense. 부산에 가봤어요. 부산에 가봤어요. 부산에 가봤어요. 부산에 가봤어요. This time I'll ask you a question and you tell me which city you have really been to. 한국에 와서 여행해 본적 있어요? 네, 서울에 가봤어요. Good. Uh, 한국에 와서 여행해 본적 있어요? 네, 청주에 가봤어요. Good. Okay, uh, 부산에 가봤어요. That was the original expression. Now, if you want to make it into a question, Eric, what do I have to do? I would raise the tone. Exactly. 부산에 가봤어요? Mm -hmm. 부산에 가봤어요? That is a question. Try that out. 부산에 가봤어요? Amur, 부산에 가봤어요? 네, 부산에 가봤어요. 네. Now, let's, let's put that together. We asked, uh, we learned how to ask a question mm -hmm. with the uh, expression, 에 가봤어요? Now, let me ask you a question. 제주도에 가봤어요? 네, 제주도에 가봤어요. How long were you there? Uh, 3박 4일. Yo! All Yo. right, 3박 4일, that's another expression that we learned. Mm -hmm. 삼박, of course, is night, three day or three nights. And, uh, of course, uh, 사 Il is four days. Sometimes it gets confusing for me as well because... I want to say the days first too. Yeah, in the American sense, we normally don't say, oh, I was there for five days and four nights. We don't really say that. If we were there for five days, it's pr pr pretty much a given that we were there for four nights as well. Think of Pak as the night. Il is the day. Like, idu, idu, il, toyo, il. That is the day, right? Mm -hmm. So, sambak sai, three nights and four days. What if it was... Seven nights and eight days. Eric? Um, bal, uh, no, seven. Seven. Chill, uh, ba, uh, bak, uh, bal il. Okay. Pal il. Pal il. Pal il. Pal il. Pal il yo. Okay. Chill bak, pal il yo. And uh, Amra, what if it was, uh, five nights and six, six days? days? Uh, five nights means, uh, Oh, Pak, mm -hmm. you give. There you go. Right. Perfect. That's uh, very, very simple enough. And Lisa, there's uh, another thing there. Nowadays, it seems that people don't really have that much time to travel and they want to make the most out of it. Right. So they will actually go on a trip where it's two days and zero nights. That's right. Mu Pak. Mu means none. Right? Uh, think of the word budio. You know, it's free, so no cost, right? Anything with the word mu, except for the, the food that you eat, mu, turn up. <laughs> Not that one. It means nothing, no expense, no cost. Uh, 
nothing at all. Mm -hmm. So here, the pak means the night member, so no nights. Mm -hmm. But, i il. Il was day, so two days and no nights. Let's try saying that. Mubak, i il. Mubak, i il. Mubak, i il. Mubak, i il. Very good. <laughs> Everybody just leave me out of everything. I mean, it's not like I'm beautiful, I have a good body, great sense of humor, and I'm smart. I'm so good at what I do in this company. I have no friends. I come to the stupid MT and nobody wants to conclude me in their conversation. Won't even let me have some sangyup sire. Oh, especially that stupid little Mr. Kim from accounting and oh, ouch, mosquitoes everywhere. Hey, do you know? Yeah, we are going to have a talent show tonight. Talent show? Yeah. And the people who will come win, we have a huge bonus. Oh, bonus? Oh. Yeah. And you know what's more? The more exciting thing is, the director himself will come and judge by himself. The director himself? Yeah. Oh my gosh, so you mean if I win this talent show, then I will be the star of the company? Yeah. Oh, come on. Let's go. We have to prepare. Yeah, let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, bye. <laughs> the director! This is my chance. I can look really good in front of him and get this big fat bonus. Yes, this is it. Yes! Oh. <laughs> this is it. <laughs> good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> and welcome to our first annual talent show, <laughs> LSK Company. <laughs> <laughs> I am very, very glad to have the opportunity yeah. of presenting you this with this kind of occasion. Yes. And I'm very eager, eager to see what kind of challenge you can show for our company. Yes, and what's more, I am honored to be the one judging you. Okay, okay. So, why don't we start? Who wants to go? Hello, I'm Lisa from the sales department. It's an honor to be here to, uh, to sing for you today. Hello. <laughs> okay, well, the stage is yours. I am Young Kim at your service. Now, check it out. Lisa is having trouble choosing a song to sing for her talent show at the MT. All right, the first one is this. Cinderella by So In Young. Na na Cinderella, na la la. Now, check it out. That's the uh, eyelash dance. It was patented by So In Young. And number two on the best songs to sing at MT talent shows is Psy. Psy is the only man, I believe, to serve in the military two terms, right? Anyhow, Psy is an entertainer and he has a song called Yonane, which means celebrity. Yonane. Good day, Yonane. That's right, check that out. That's the number two song, Psy is Yonane, or celebrity.
And the third and final song is by Korea's Madonna. She is a fashion queen. At the same time, she's multi-talented. Om Jung Hwa. She's in movies. She's in dramas. She does everything. Now, Om Jung Hwa had a song out called Mola. Mola, I suga up so. What? What? Mola. Mola means I don't know. I suga up so. I cannot know. I don't know. Basically. Mola. So if, you, if someone asks you a question and you don't know the answer to it, you can just say Mola. But this is an awesome song that you can get down with at MTs. Mola, I suga up so. Round six. Now we're finally at the final round. It's time to decide who the ultimate winner is going to be. That's right. Who's it going to be? Is it going to be Amr or is it going to be Eric? Right now, Amr is going to go ahead first, and uh, you know the name of the game. It's the speed game, the That's sixth right. round. We have exactly ten questions. Mm -hmm. Each question worth ten points. And if you get all ten correctly within the sixty-second time limit, then you get a bonus point of. 20, 20 points. points. So there's a total of 120 points that you could gain in this round. Of course, for fairness sake, Eric will be listening to some music so yep. we can't hear the questions. And Armor will go first. Are you ready? Ready. All right, let's get started. 60 seconds starting now. And here's the first question. Have you ever traveled after you came to Korea in Korean? Number two, I've been to Busan. Busan에 가봤어요. Number three, I've been to Sokcho. Sokcho에 가봤어요. Number four, I'm going on an MT with my company. 회사에서 MT 가요. Number five, seven nights and eight days. In Korean? Honorific. 7, 8, 8, 8. Number six, two nights and three days. Honorific in Korean. Number seven, nine nights and ten days. In Korean, honorific. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Time. Shibirio. Kupak Shibirio. Too late. Sixty seconds starting now. Number one, have you ever traveled after coming to Korea in Korean? Hangul에 와서 여행해 본 적이 있어요? Number two, I've been to Busan in Korean. Busan에 가 봤어요. Number three, I've been to Sokcho in Korean. Sokcho에 가 봤어요. Number four, I'm going on an MT with my company in Korean. 회사에서 MT 가요. Number five, seven nights and eight days in Korean honorific. Chill back, pal, il yo. Number six, two nights and three days in Korean honorific. E back, sam il yo. Number seven, nine nights and ten days in Korean honorific. Go back, ship il yo. Number eight, I've been to Anando in Korean. Amyondoe Gabwasoyo. Number nine, four nights and five days in Korean. Honorific Sabak O Ilyo. One minute! Number two. And at the end of six rounds, here we are with our finalists. Uh, Mur and Eric. Amur, uh, pretty cold there, right? Yeah, it's so cold. All right, I'll be sure to hurry up. Yeah. Let's go and find out today's final. Final winner! And I have the scores that are tallied up right here, right now! Drum roll, guys! And uh, Eric comes out of the sixth round with a total score of 165 points! Yeah! That was uh, pretty high scoring there, but... But, there's always a but. The unstoppable Amur! wins Ow! this Ow! episode with 215 points.
Oh, loser. Christine and Cherish were knocked out in round three. After some intense competition between Eric and Amur, Amur wins with 50 more points. Congratulations. All right, that things would go through for television, right? I hope you're enjoying our Sohan special. We certainly had a wonderful time shooting it for you. Let's go over our expressions for today. The very first one, that long expression was, 한국에 와서 여행해본 적 있어요? 한국에 와서 여행해본 적 있어요? 한국 is, of course, Korea. 와서, coming to. So after coming to Korea, 여행, travel. 해본 적 있어요? This you should memorize as one verb. Have you ever had the experience of doing something? Have you ever done something? So here it's travel. So have you ever traveled around Korea after coming to Korea? Let's try saying the sentence together. 한국에 와서 여행해본 적 있어요? 한국에 와서 여행해본 적 있어요? Very good. Let's answer. I've been to Busan. Busan is the port city, right? So. 부산에 가본 적 있어요. 부산에 가봤어요. You can use both. They both mean, the first one means, of course, I've had the experience of going to Busan. And the second one is, 가봤어요. I've been there. All right, at the office, we're going to go on an MT. Do you guys remember what MT meant? Membership training. It's a Konglish word. It's uh, a thing that many people in the office or people who work together do. They go on uh, a trip, eat lots of great food, and get to know each other, fraternize with each other. So that's an MT. 회사에서 MT 가요. 회사에서 MT 가요. We're going on an MT at the office. All right, after that, we learned three nights and four days. Do you remember how to say that? Sam bak, which was nights, right? Sa il. Il is day. Sam bak sailyo. Sam bak sailyo. And of course, the last expression hey, go and come back in peace or uh, without any worries. Tai gata useo. Tai gata useo. So, everyone, if someone goes on a trip, you can say, Tai gata useo. And that rocks up the last two weeks of the Sohean Tuk Jip. That's our West Coast special. We really hope you enjoyed it. We had a fantastic time, ate lots of delicious food, and we hope to do this again soon. But of course, we will join you in the studio next week. So how did you guys feel? Of course, uh, these last two episodes, I think, mm -hmm. even were hard, but that was like the most exciting and interesting experience in LSK The Game. That's right. It was very hard, but it was very educational as well because we, we were able to see a lot of places here in Korea and learn a lot of um, Korean expressions. That's right. Busan go Manuko. We had lots of injuries too. Yeah. What about Christine? And I think we did a lot of exercising these two days. Yeah. And I really miss the time that we find you with the guys because we are the girls are very good team. Go go Eric? One word. Extreme. Yeah. Oh, extreme you. LSK. Yeah. Let's be Korean. Yeah. All right, the last two weeks we had our special. We still have four more weeks with um, our contestants. You know, you guys are going to give us a more even, even more fierce battle and competition um, in the next four weeks, right? Yeah. yeah. All right, so join us um, next week. And also, another thing, if you're interested, if you have any messages, if you're interested in being a contestant, if you want to leave a message on the board, just come to arirang.co.kr, the LSK, the game message board, and leave a message. That's right. Come and join us at arirang.co.kr, and we will see you guys very soon. Annyeonghi! Yay! Leave a message on the board for your chance to win LSK t-shirts. Don't miss your chance to win.